when I was coming up, I had to double up and tell these niggas fucking love before they ride. And they don't really want to knock a love, I hit him with the uppercut, I had these motherfuckers running for their lives. So I identify trap when I'm flying past, I'm an alien sailing, and if you look up in the sky. Oh, Alexa! Okay, Alexa, turn on loft lights. Okay. Mm. Mm, quite good harmonies. And a one, a two, a one, two, three, four. Yo, guys, it's Lee. Today we are going for a week. And then what we'll do is we'll sit here and we'll eat each other's poop. Yo guys, it's Lee. How we all doing? I am good. I oh, I got a I got a notification. Commence! Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you've been enjoying my videos recently. And if you have, make sure you go down on this one and you comment. Sunglasses. Just because why not? The sun's been out recently, you need sunglasses to block the sun. Apart from today, it's raining. Today's a really bad day, it's raining really bad. For my previous video, the Yanni vs Laurel video, you guys smashed it down in the comments and with the likes. So if we could do that today, if you could just go down there, leave a random comment, anything, anything random, I'll give you a um, tub of Vaseline. The most random comment down in the comment section, let's aim for over a thousand comments. And the most random comment in the comment section will get this very huge tub of lip therapy mm. lip therapy vaseline petroleum jelly cocoa butter anyway enough of that what we are going to be doing in today's video is i have my phone as i'm sure a lot of other you <sighs> can't speak as i'm sure a lot of as i'm sure a lot of other you guys as i'm sure a lot of you people have a phone along with the phone comes apps along with apps comes snapchat now if you want to add me on snapchat i will put my scan code thing right hither go scan me up you know i post weird stories sometimes i'll film a weird story right now for you to watch hey hey you you there yeah you you come on then come at me now i'll have you for my breakfast with these nostrils they look like calves calves and on that note, I'm pretty certain I need help. Anyway, what I'm going to be doing in this video is using Snapchat because your boy is going to sit here and expose my secret Snapchat memories. So every single video I have filmed on Snapchat and not posted it to my story so you guys will not have seen them because they are not allowed to go on my story for obvious reasons. Um, moving on. A lot of them are saved into my memories and I'm going to go through and look at some from when I first started my YouTube Snapchat account because before I started YouTube, I had like a private... I have a Snapchat account that I Snapchat friends on from school and stuff and I had a YouTube one that I just posted stories on. Now, my YouTube one is my one that I Snapchat friends and stuff on. So, I have some Snapchats that I sent to my friends that are me just being stuff like what you've just witnessed. So, we're going to have a bit of fun, you know, go through my Snapchat memories, see what's happening on the phone of Lee Hinchcliffe. And I've got a red iPhone. Does anybody else have a red iPhone? In fact, let me ask you a question. If you saw my last video, you will know what I am getting at here. What colour do you see this as, eh? Is it red or is it gold? I'm kidding, obviously it's red, there's no colourness in this that makes it look different. Uh, have five. My boy, Hachik. My boy, Hachin. Hmm, take a Hachin. Oh, Cinder Lee, here I have a slider that would fit your foot. Pass me your foot like this. Here we go. Oh, 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 oh there we go. Oh, oh wow, it, it fits perfectly. Who am I talking to? Why is my leg up here? Uh, everyone like and subscribe. Oh, oh god, I've just nearly torn my ligamonte. Okay, so enough of me being weird now. What I'm gonna do is get on my phone, go on Snapchat, and scroll all the way to the bottom of my Snapchat memories. And then this is where we start exposing my Snapchat memories. I hope there's no pictures of my poo poo on here. Not that I take pictures of my poo anyway. Scrolling all the way to the bottom. Come on. Oh, I can just click, can I? I can click somewhere. So this starts from August 2016, I think this starts. This is about two years ago. Is it two years ago? Yeah, maybe it's about two years. No. The first one we see right here is this one. Picture with good old Marina Joyce. Yeah, so let me explain that picture. Basically, that is when I attended my first summer in the city. And I am also going to summer in the city this year. I am on the lineup. So if you guys are going to summer in the city, make sure you get... No, wait. 
Oh. If you're not going to Marina City, make sure you get tickets to come to Marina City and then you'll have a chance of meeting me. You will most likely meet me because I will probably be doing meet and greets and stuff. So you will meet me. Don't you worry about that, boys and girls. But anyway, I was at some Marina City and after some Marina City, there are creator parties. And I went to the party and me and Jake were on the dance floor thing at where the party was. We were just talking to some people and then we turned around and Marina Joyce was there. And at this point, this is a couple of like probably weeks after the whole Marina Joyce scene was going about on YouTube and if you guys don't remember that it was the sort of thing where like people thought Marina Joyce was getting controlled she was on drugs maybe it was just it was a weird scene for YouTube and a lot of people then thought Marina Joyce went missing uh, not really sure why that happened but a lot of people thought that and basically we saw Marina Joyce and we were like oh should we just go say hello you know we're at a party there's loads of other YouTubers there we were talking to everyone so we just sort of like we just wanted to be polite you know just go say hello so we went over we said hello and I don't know I don't know how to put this it was it wasn't a normal conversation I I'll put it that way the conversation that I had with her it wasn't normal she's a really nice person I'm not gonna lie like loads of people were like oh she's weird blah 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 she's really nice but it wasn't a normal conversation it was like I went up and, I, and we, we said hello and stuff and she was like hi I'm Arena and I'm like hi I'm Lee and then <laughs> we'd introduce ourselves and I literally went hi I'm Lee I didn't know what else to say, I'm not gonna lie. I only, I just wanted to go say hello just to be polite and we continued to stare at each other like this. Yeah, did you feel awkward with me staring at you like that then? We must have stared at each other for at least a good 30 seconds, but it felt like the longest 30 seconds of my life. And then after that, I was like, oh, first thing that comes to mind, uh, let, let's get a picture. Trying to get a picture of Snapchat? She was like, oh yeah, of course, let's do it. So I was like, yay, Marina Joyce, got it on Snapchat. And that, that was that. But yeah, like I said, she was a nice person, but it was just awkward because we didn't know each other. And we was at a party and I was just like, oh, let's say hello. Hi. Uh... Bye. After the picture with Marina Joyce, there is this video. My. No. 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 What? What? As you can see, that is when I hit 20,000 subscribers. How many am I on now? 245,000. That was 225,000 subscribers ago. Did I do my maths correctly then? If not, let me know down in the comments below. I'm not too sure. But all I can say for that one is. Thank you. Thank you. It's, 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 it's quite crazy thinking back at that point, like maybe two years ago, I was on 20,000 subscribers and two years later, I'm on 245,000 subscribers. Where did you all come from? And I know you came out of your mum's. Whoa, moving on. Uh... <laughs> Where did you all come from? How did you find my channel? Let me know down in the comments below how you guys found my channel. And if you subscribed straight away, if you subscribed after a while, if you subscribed, unsubscribed, and then subscribed again, you know? If you don't like me, and then you did like me, and then you don't like me, and then you like me again. That does happen sometimes. And a lot of people still don't like me. But I'm good. Oh, okay, this one, this one then. Uh, yeah, I can I can explain that picture. So for those of you guys that didn't see that like two years ago, or you can't remember that two years ago, what happened is, let me just scooch up a bit because it's story time. What happened is it was one of my friend's 18th birthdays and he had a party for his birthday. And obviously, you know, being one of the boys, all of the lads at the party, we decided to get our eyebrows slit for some reason. It was just like, oh, oh it's, it's your 18th. Oh, you know what? Let's do something loud. Let's get our eyebrows slitted. And we did. But we didn't, like, you know, do it professionally. You know, like some barbers or hairdressers will put a slit in your eyebrow while you're getting your hair cut or anything like that. No. We did it ourselves. We did it in the bathroom with a razor and just went to everyone's eyebrows. And there was at least 10 lads there. Oops, sorry. There were at least 10 lads there. And we all were just like, yeah, come on, do it. Right there. Come on. And another one. Oh, yeah. There you go. And another one. And we were just doing that all the way around. And it got to the last person. And one of the boys thought it'd be very funny and do it there in one of the boy's eyebrows and let's just say he said oh no I don't like it so he made it thicker his gap in his eyebrow must have been about that big so you imagine that gap there just down the middle of your eyebrow his eyebrow was basically slit in half mine was a subtle little split I was like oh no please please be careful when you do this because I get my eyebrows done. Anyway, um, please be careful when you do this because I still want an eyebrow left. But for that one, no, they just went all out and he nearly lost all of his eyebrow. <laughs> you know, crazy guys, that's what we are. Right, so this next video that I'm about to show you right now, this is when I actually used to go to college. Because this is when I had an apprenticeship. I had to go to college once a week and this is basically all I did on those days. <laughs> Bit of 
Ariana Grande in the background there, you know, my G. But yeah, that was a fridgy milkshake, and every single Monday, I would go to college. At dinner time, we would go down to Asda or something, get something to eat. I got a fridgy milkshake, and I would literally drink it until there's enough water to do a bottle flip. Maybe not like that. Every Monday we would just spend dinner times doing ball flips like that. You could tell I was 16. Oh my god, I was 16 at that point. I was 16. I still feel like I'm 7. Or 5. And I'm 18. But you see that? Bad boy bottle flip skills. Up and over and then through the legs and hit the camera. And I even had my girl Ariana Grande listening to me while I did it. Safety. I'm just gonna pull myself. <laughs> Um, no words, no words for that one. Driving home for Christmas. <laughs> I can't do it. I don't know any more words. <laughs> well, that was obviously when it was getting close to Christmas, and I thought I was um, this guy. Driving home for Christmas. Oh, I can't play Christmas music when it's not Christmas because it's. Bad luck. And Santa won't come and give you any presents. Oh, who remembers this bad boy then? See that? That is when me and Joe became friends, even though it's not. It was the first time we met, it was a bit different. That was after we became friends. And that is when we filmed the Christmas carpool karaoke, but that is when... What was that challenge called? Oh, what was that challenge called? This... Oh, no, I can't remember what it was called. Oh, what was it called? This statue challenge or something. The black... That Black Beatles song. That girl is a real proud piece. Small world, all the... Ah, blinked! Ow! Let me try it again. I blinked. And yeah, we decided to do the Black Beatles thingy, whatever it was, in the car, and Joe decided to scoff some ice cream at the end of it. The fight. I'm gonna research what that challenge was called, I forgot. What was the Black Beatles song challenge called? <gasps> mannequin challenge! Oh, that's the one, the mannequin challenge. We were doing the mannequin challenge. Right, next one, let's see if I can find something juicy. Not too juicy though, I'm PG, but you know, juicy enough. Oh my god, okay, this is not juicy, but this is like one of mine and Joe's favorite ever things. Me and Joe used to be obsessed with boomerangs. We always used to be like, here, boomerang me doing this. Here, boomerang this. Boomerang me doing that. Quite crazy. This is where the ear boomerang me doing this started. Hello there, guys. Me and Joe, we have the whole cart to ourselves. Yeah, boomerang me doing a skiddy. Ear <laughs> boomerang me doing it. A skiddy. Not in trousers, though. I hope not, Joseph. If anybody's ever heard me and Joe go, yeah, boomerang me doing this. Or this exact phrase. Yeah, boomerang me on this. Oh. oh my god, I need to send Joe this right. Basically, as we were coming back from the cinema, Joe did that for my Snapchat. He went, yeah, boomerang me doing a skiddy. And then we got further down the steps and there was like a zebra crossing thing with some lights. And then Joe went, yeah, boomerang me on the zebra crossing. And I just, for some reason, turned around to him and I went, Oh, I went, all right then. <laughs> it was just went, It was one of those be there moments when you had to be there for it to be a moment. Oh, smells. <laughs> oh, so this was a very long time ago. This is when, this is when I was with Jake James and we just celebrated for Jake releasing Echoes, which was a long time ago. It was at this moment, like this like week where this video was filmed. We were vlogging and stuff. And every time James laughed, he did that really weird laugh for some reason. And we woke up that morning and James was saying something to Jake, but Jake was still like half asleep. So Jake looked just kind of like mumbled to answer James. And then James just came out with that laugh. <laughs> oh, that video is never gonna get old. <laughs> oh, I just found one. I think I'm gonna have to blur it. Let me just watch it again. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Listen to the volume first. Just listen to the sound of it. I can't put this. I can't physically put this on YouTube because of what it shows. But just listen. <laughs> That is Jake saying, don't fall out anywhere. When we were in LA, not the most recent time, we were in LA one or two years ago, I can't remember now. Jake was 
Jake was having a poo. Sorry, Jake, put it out there, but you're human. You poo. And I thought it was like cool just to be on Snapchat and stroll in the bathroom and just Snapchat him on the toilet. And that is all I'm gonna say. That is why it cannot go on YouTube. So moving on to the next one. That's when you know that you boys you can do that. It's still very weird. Moving on. Oh my god, guys, right, this, this video I'm about to show you, you've all you've all seen this, but it's just on my memories. This was the first time I ever went to Joe's old apartment in London. I've not even seen his new one yet. We've both been too busy, but I will be visiting Joe very soon. But this was what the first time I ever went to his old apartment in London. I love Joseph. I miss you, Joseph, if you're watching. And this one, this next one, right? This one was literally at, I think, 2.30 a.m. This video was at 2.30 a.m. Clipped his tooth. His tooth nearly snapped off because I threw one of those little like strawberry sweet hard bonbon things at his tooth. Just listen, see if you can hear the on his tooth. This video that I'm gonna show you, I will have to bleep it because of what he says, but it's just funny because of the way that he reacts. But this is these are just memories with my Joseph. I didn't, I said floop. I said floop, floop. <laughs> I just went, ah! and he was just concentrating so hard anyway. <gasps> oh, Josie, if I miss him. Guys, who wants more Task Cliff videos? Let me know down in the comments below. Who's ready for this video of Kami's dancing? Kami looks like he's homeless. Can everyone screenshot this picture of Kami when he comes up on screen with his beard? Screenshot him and tag me and him and get him to watch his video. Kami, this is when you have beard and now you've not got a beard. We literally went outside Joe's apartment and saw this little guy sat on the curb. And we thought, oh, we feel sorry for you. And we went, what's your name? And he went, like that. And I, I said to him, why are you doing that? And he just sat there like that. And I went, what are you doing? And he goes, I'm touching the light. Put <laughs> him. <laughs> okay, maybe not. I really don't know whether I should show you guys all of this. I uh, there's going to be certain things I can show, certain things I can't. Right. So, uh, <laughs> does everybody remember this? Right. Everyone remembers that tattoo, and that is from when me and Jake went to Malia. We actually went on a family holiday to Crete and snuck off to Malia one of the nights because we had a bit too much to drink, and we thought, yeah, let's go to Malia and have more to drink, and yeah, things escalated and we got tattoos. I have a few videos on my phone right here in my Snapchat memories from that night of Great. Right, so I'll show you this first one. This this one is very, very simple, but you could tell that we may have had a little bit. I've got nothing. Jake's got a ring. I got nothing. I've got a ring. Oh, taxi. 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 Pop it. Pop it. Okay, don't pop it. <laughs> I don't actually know what to say. I've got a nice tan, put it that way. I am looking very nice and brown, but uh, yeah. I don't know. Uh, that, that was the start. That was when we were getting the taxi to Malia. That's very normal. Let me just have a look through, see what I can show. <laughs> I can't show you that. Oh dear. Oh no. Oh, that. Oh dear. Oh dear. Right, also listen to this. I know what this video is before I even click on it, and I will tell you now it is mental. Just listen. <laughs> Dear, oh dear. Right, long story short on that one. We went to Malia, we met some boys, we joined their group, and we went along to another club, found this beer pong table, played beer pong, I got shot in, and everyone went wild. That is long story short. I am not showing that because it is 
Next, next level. But moving on. Right, so on that note, I'm going to end that video there anyway. I've still got a fair few Snapchats that I could go through. So if you guys want to see a part two to this video, let me know down in the comments below because I will do a part two. But for now, that is it. I know there were like some things on there that you guys probably really want to see, but I physically cannot show them on YouTube. Otherwise, I may even get my video taken down. So I don't want to risk that. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you go down there and leave a like below. Also, if you are new to my channel, make sure you go down there and subscribe. I would really, really, really appreciate that. Like I said, go down in the comments below. Leave some comments. Leave the most random comment and you will win this tub of Vaseline. Oh dear. Let's try and get over a thousand comments on this video. That would be amazing. I love you all. Thank you for watching. Mmm. I love water. Make sure you got yourself some merch. Lee-gift.shopfryband.com It is fire, yo. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video. Peace.